Memphis has a very long story, and it can be a very conflicted story at times. It's gone from one place to the other and, and back again. Sweet tea, coming up. There was great food when I got here, or there's even better food that I see popping up everywhere. Sliced beef sandwich mild, no slaw, beans and potato salad, a sweet tea, a sliced beef mild with slaw. My name is Kelly English. I've got two restaurants here in Memphis, Tennessee, Restaurant Irish in the Second Line, and I'm going to take you around a little bit today. If you look at, at Memphis, the blues really speaks well to who we are. You know, the blues is the most American music there is, and it's the backbone of, of most of the music we hear today. Memphis is Elvis, and Memphis is a, a fried peanut butter and banana sandwich, and it is blues, and it is everything. It's hard working. Cozy Corner, which is one of the best barbecue places anywhere. It's this little old shack right on the cusp of downtown. It looks like a barbecue restaurant. It's worn. The sign's not brand new. Cozy Corner is the most quintessential barbecue restaurant. You can really taste the way that barbecue's been done for so long there. You walk up to order at the cash register, and to your left is the open pit. It's glassed in. You can see exactly what they're doing. I've been using all charcoal. Uh, you know, my whole existence. We don't use any thermometers, no timers. You know, you have to know what you're doing. Hey man, I appreciate it. Nope. I'm gonna sit and chow down on some of your rib tips. Good deal. Their sides are all wonderful, but rib tips are my favorite. There's barbecue, and then there's real barbecue. To me, real barbecue, it's not a gentrified version of itself. It is the way it's been forever. It's slow, it's messy, it's bluesy, it's fun. It does exactly what it intends to do, and that's bring people together. And that's what Cozy Corner is all about. We're going to Hog and Hominy. It's one of my favorite places in town to eat. Andy and Michael are two of my favorite friends anywhere. You can go there and you can get a hot dog, you can get a pizza, you can get sweetbreads, so many things that they do there. I think they've really succeeded just making a restaurant where they cook things that they want to eat. Andy and Michael really do an incredible job of marrying their southern roots and their Italian roots. Cooking things that aren't really either southern or Italian, but hit right in the middle. You know, I'm lucky I don't work there because they would catch me in the walk-in eating their beef and cheddar dogs all the time. <laughs> Ernestine and Hazel's is this place downtown. It's been many things throughout the years. It's been a brothel, it's been a sundry store, it's been many things. Now it's the best bar on earth. It's almost indescribable how just Memphis this place is. And the, the floor is not perfect, the walls are kind of broken. And it's the, the greatest place on earth to get a cold, cheap beer and a soul burger. And a Soul Burger is a burger that's been cooked on the same flat top with this marinade that they won't tell anyone what's in it. You, you get your burger and your chips and your beer. It's awesome. They got the best jukebox you ever saw in your life. There's so many things that it is and so many things that it isn't, and there's, there's only one of them. That's the common theme that I, I find with Andy and Mike's restaurants and Cozy Corner and Ernestine and Hazel's, and I, I like to think what we do here there's only one of these places, and like nobody else could have done any one of these places except the people that did them. <laughs>